Nestled high in the imposing Taihang Mountains of Henan Province, China, lies the Goliang Tunnel, a remarkable testament to human ingenuity, unwavering perseverance, and the indomitable spirit of a small, isolated village. Before its construction, the village of Goliang existed in a state of near-total isolation, accessible only by a treacherous, narrow path clinging precariously to the sheer cliffs of the mountainside, a path so daunting it was known locally as the Sky Ladder. This perilous route, carved into the rock face over generations, presented an almost insurmountable barrier to the outside world, severely limiting the villagers' ability to transport goods, communicate effectively, and participate fully in the broader society. The challenges posed by this precarious access profoundly impacted the lives of the Goliang villagers, restricting their economic opportunities and isolating them from essential services and modern conveniences. Recognizing the desperate need for a more reliable and safe means of access, 13 courageous villagers, led by the visionary Shen Mingxin, embarked on an ambitious and seemingly impossible undertaking in 1972, they would carve a road through the solid rock of the Taihang Mountains. Armed with nothing more than hand tools, hammers, chisels, and a limited supply of explosives, they began the arduous task of excavating a tunnel through the unforgiving mountainside. The work was backbreaking, dangerous, and fraught with peril. The sheer cliffs presented constant challenges, demanding meticulous precision and unwavering determination. The villagers faced the constant threat of rockfalls, the ever-present risk of explosions, and the grueling physical demands of the labor. Tragically, one villager lost their life during the construction, a somber reminder of the risks they willingly accepted in pursuit of their collective goal. Progress was agonizingly slow, averaging a mere one meter every three days at the most challenging points of the excavation. The process was further complicated by the need to create over 30 windows along the tunnel's length. These windows, initially necessary to facilitate the removal of rubble and provide much-needed light before the tunnel was electrified, now serve as unique architectural features, offering glimpses of the stunning mountain scenery. After five years of relentless toil, sweat, and sacrifice, the Goliang Tunnel was finally completed on May 1, 1977. This remarkable feat of engineering, achieved with minimal resources and unwavering determination, instantly transformed the lives of the Goliang villagers. The tunnel, measuring 1.2 kilometers (0.75 miles) in length, 5 meters (16 feet) high, and 4 meters (13 feet) wide, provided a vital link to the outside world, facilitating the transport of goods and people, and opening up new economic opportunities. The once isolated village blossomed, attracting tourists drawn by the breathtaking scenery and the inspiring story of the tunnel's creation. Today. Goliang boasts improved infrastructure, including hotels and other amenities to accommodate visitors, a testament to the enduring legacy of the tunnel. The Goliang Tunnel stands as a powerful symbol of human resilience, community spirit, and the extraordinary capacity of individuals to overcome seemingly insurmountable obstacles through collective effort and unwavering determination. It is a story of courage, sacrifice, and the transformative power of human ingenuity, etched into the very rock of the Taihang Mountains.